help you make coffee and give you honest reviews. Today, I am here at the Yoga Bar and Cafe. Brand new, opening soon, or slightly open. And uh, we have a Bedsera Strega here. So this is a very fun spring labor machine that I kind of want to show off a little bit. And we have a very special barista to help uh, kind of guide us through using it. Howdy. So uh, we have that, and then we also have a, a Libra here. I think these are really, really awesome. I've already reviewed it. If you want to check out that review, I'll link it in the description above uh, and put a little link there. So you can click on that, and I have a full review on that. And it's a really, really nice machine because grind by weight. You know how much I like grinding by weight because it just makes it a lot easier, less simp you know, a lot less coffee waste because a lot of times you're grinding and throwing stuff out. It's really nice. Anyways, Cassie, why don't you jump in and Amazing. let's make a shot here. So I'm going to just kind of explain the, the Betsera Strega. It's not the same as a lot of other machines out there. It is a spring lever machine, um, which means some machines you are pushing, you're pulling the, the, the lever and what pressure you're making onto the coffee is how much pressure you're pushing down on the lever. On this, you pull it down and the spring slowly brings it up. So you're starting at nine bars and as it goes up, the pressure goes lower. So you're kind of getting the best of, of, uh, of your espresso because you're pulling high, high pressure and then slowly lowering that pressure when, you're, when your shot and your puck is you know, dissolving. So un one unfortunate thing about the machine is this plastic tamper. I, uh, it'd be really nice if they added a metal one. I think it's kind of goofy that they did that, but especially on a machine as expensive as this. But it gets the job done for right now. And we did just hook this up. So we didn't get time to buy all the fun stuff. And then um, also this is one of the uh, nice functions of this is that you can actually plumb this directly in. So whether you're a home or a cafe, you can plumb that in. All right, so now that she pulled it down, we're doing a pre-infusion. She set the timer. We're gonna do a 10 second pre-infusion and then we'll start lifting that up. So now that spring is gonna go slightly up. You can see the shot there. It's actually pulling quite nice. Now realize you don't have to wait for the entire shot to pull. You're gonna to wanna to pull that out a little bit beforehand. So right about 30 seconds, like Cassie just did. Pull that out. Let's, oops, sorry. Trade you. She's got some uh, milk already going. Nice shot, nice crema, looks great. All right. And I can't believe how good the steam pressure is on this thing. I, I, uh, I was expecting it to have a little bit of water sputtering and stuff, but it really doesn't. Pressure's on, Cassie. I know. Getting used to the steam one. Yeah, learning curve on all of them. I think we're doing oat milk, right? Mm -hmm. Nice. Folks that have questions, definitely leave it in the comments. We could answer them. Uh, as they come in, so if you have any questions, definitely shoot them in there. Don't wipe this off here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Pressure's on. You gotta get art now. Uh-oh. I don't know about it. We'll find out. Oat milk's impossible with it. I always have the hardest time. Oh. Oh. It's, it's a, a baby heart. It's a baby heart. It's a tiny heart for a giant cup. Yeah. <laughs> it's the Grinch's heart before it grew. That's right. That's exactly what I was going for. How'd you know? Nice. All right, well, that's the Bedzera Strega. 
Only thing we didn't show off was the hot water tap. But uh, yeah, I, I think this machine is awesome. It's really cool to, you know, grab that lever, pull it down, and pull a normal, sh like an actual shot of espresso. I think that's where the term actually comes from, is pulling a shot of espresso. But um, yeah, let me do a quick taste test too, because it just looks too, too beautiful to not taste. Oh yeah, I love oat milk. Me too. I like it more than, than normal milk. Call me crazy. <laughs> Anyways, so that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, definitely quickly leave it in the comments, but uh, definitely leave a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, come check out the yoga bar and cafe over there. <laughs> It's in Green, Ohio, so if you're around there in the Canton area, definitely stop in. If you come here, I'll be here, probably. She'll be here. This is a third appearance from Cassie, right. the latte art extraordinaire. Uh, but yeah, and then also I'm going to be in, the, in Portland for the Coffee Expo in a few days, so definitely any questions you have or anything you want to see there, leave them in the comments, hit me up on Instagram, and I will make sure I check that out. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next video. See you later.